Hi everyone, my name is Martin and today I'll tell you how I built a personalized AI based newsletter. So in the last video, I was telling you how I built a whole business plan, a whole marketing plan, even brainstormed the name of the newsletter with ChatGPT. I even asked for software and tech recommendations and boy did it deliver. ChatGPT is amazing tool and you can use it for so many use cases. Today I'll show you how I actually executed and built that newsletter. If you want to get into more details of how I brainstormed the ideas, what questions I was asking, you can check the previous video. Now we're going to discuss how actually the newsletter starts to look like. Um, we're going to discuss how I build it and what features it has inside and how ChatGPT is able to help to filter out the news so that it can deliver the most relevant news for each user. And the best part about it is that every newsletter edition is absolutely different for all the users and every week it brings new content, it brings new news and all the features inside which are absolutely tailored to each user's experience. So. It's very, very exciting. All right, let's go. So starting with the landing page, as you see, it, uh, it has this futuristic look and the background and it just states the title. It's just a template basically that asks for your name, asks for your interests and for your email. And the interest could be really anything like art, chess, Tesla, Elon Musk. Some people put their philosophy, spirituality, and they get very interesting content. So after that, I added a little bit of copy just to highlight that this is AI powered newsletter. And what is really uh, interesting about it and like unique is that it really brings out attention to your topic. So the things that you are interested so this is something that I wanted to highlight and to bring more attention to. All right, so below that, I just put uh, some videos of basic explanation. What is that idea and why is it out there? And then some frequently asked questions like, is it free? Are there ads inside? And how am I going to make money on that if there is none of these? So basically for now it's free, but in the future there will be some more features that would be paid. And so it will be kind of like a freemium model. Uh, so I will discuss this in a future video when I actually have it figured out. That's, the, that's it basically, that's the landing page. It's just a, a place where I could capture these details about all the interested people. As you see, the domain name is AIinsider.co. It's right what AI suggested. So basically from here on, my next step was that I wanted to provide uh, three important things to users that are relevant every week. I wanted to bring them news, interesting stories, what's the latest tweets and just to expose them to something different than maybe what they're used to read and also music recommendations. I'll show you how I built all of that. Okay, so for the news, I was thinking what news sources I could use. So I just went ahead and I typed news API in a Google search and there are plenty of them. Uh, there's so many APIs and the reason that I didn't use ChatGPT for that is that it actually has knowledge about things until September 2021 and now it's 2023 and I wanted to know if there is something more relevant, more interesting out there. So I still haven't figured out which API I want to use for long term. And the reason for that is that some of them bring a lot of noise in the news. So they would bring a lot of other articles which are not really related to the topic I'm asking about. And I resolved that problem with ChatGPT. So you can see in the next video how I solved for that problem. But still I want to choose a source of news that would be very good, that would decrease that amount of uh, requests I made to ChatGPT so that it can really ease the workload and eventually the expenses on that idea. So for now, I'm still looking for which is the best one. If you know, please let me down in the comments. All right, so these are news. Um, then tweets, uh, I was thinking how do I get the best tweets out there and the most relevant and guess what? Just looked for Twitter API. And sure enough, there it is. So Twitter has an API where you could go around and you can uh, just extract various properties of tweets. So basically the one that I went for is a tweak related to a topic that has the most likes and the most retweets. All right, the third one, music recommendations. 
So I was thinking I would want to give something interesting to every user every week that is different and kind of bring up the mood. So I asked ChatGPT if it can provide music recommendations based on articles that uh, the users have seen so far. So here is how I did it. OpenAI is the company that stays behind ChatGPT and it builds the artificial intelligence and the chat is kind of like a wrapper around that. So here is how it goes. I just typed in, suggest me two artists and albums for a newsletter subscriber who likes artificial intelligence, entrepreneurship and board games. Go figure, that's me. All right, let's see what it gives. Eric Pride's Opus, amazing song. I really like that one. Uh, the Glitch Mob, See Without Eyes. So this album is a journey into the minds of entrepreneurs exploring the boundaries between reality and virtuality and how board games can affect our lives. Isn't that beautiful? So the AI is able to give music recommendations based on the things that uh, people like. And I even fine-tuned it more and I added the news articles that they're reading every week and suggest music based on that vibe so that every week people can get music which is really relevant to the news they read. All right, so let me show you how the newsletter actually looks like. So this is how it starts. AI is the topic, the topics that I like, and uh, it suggests an image that is based on mid-journey. If you're interested to know how to use that, uh, let me know in the comments and I can make a video about that as well. So basically the news for last week, there was uh, AI chatbots to change education forever within six months and uh, some abstract here. There are up and down buttons that are feeding into the algorithm what news are actually relevant or not relevant for me. And I will make a video that you could look into and see how you can make a personalized system with ChatGPT yourself. Okay, so here are the news and as you see, there are so many things happening out there. Uh, for example, this is the tweet of the week for entrepreneurship. Uh, lastly, the board games. So there are some articles about that as well. And at the bottom is, uh, well, another tweet of the week for that topic. And at the bottom, there is the weekly music recommendation. So uh, basically for that week, for me, it suggests uh, William Basinski, the disintegration loops, part one and two, and Brian Eno with MBN4 on land. This is how the newsletter looks like. Um, it provides different news to different people. Uh, it provides different music recommendations to different people. So it's actually pretty exciting to see how this thing develops and what is the feedback of, pe of the people. So if you're interested to learn more about that, please like and subscribe. That would really help me a lot. And make sure to check the next video to see how the progress is going and what new features I'm gonna build in.